Quarterback Club, and I'm on the river, and this is Mike Sobert, and we'll be answering a few questions tonight on Friday night's game and on future games of Mop Town this coming up Friday night. Uh, again, I'm saying I'm Mike McGregor, and I play defensive end and fullback, as well as halfback and flanker for all County Tigers. Uh, my defensive end position is really the cornerback position. I'm mainly responsible for the flats, so five yards deep and pass coverage. And I have the quarterback on tight defenses, and I also have the pitch man most of the time. And uh, that's mainly my responsibilities as in defense and offense. I usually at at, at flanker I'm usually out on pro or in blocking, so I'm usually a blocker on offense. My name is Mike Cyrus, my said, and uh, I play defensive guard for the defense and the. I play offensive tackle. Uh, on defense, as a guard, I'm mainly concerned with the inside plays, the dive up the middle or the trap. As the coaches say, it's 60% inside and 40% outside. Uh, the new defense we have is six defense, and it's a reading defense. And you could say I got a head start on everyone else learning the, the new defense because this uh, summer in June, I went to UK's football camp and. It helped me out considerably because that's what we worked on mainly with reading. And on offense, I play a tackle, as I said, and uh, you know we the Caldwell's known for the power and the, the trap, so you know we we think we're gonna have a good year this year. Bonnie, I'll ask you this question. We've had some injuries on our football field lately. I know uh, Mike Walker was injured. Uh, in the last Friday night's game, and so was uh, Demetri. Can you tell us anything uh, about those two fellows? Well, Mike Michael Walker, he's a real good back. He's been doing a real excellent, excellent job of blocking as well as running. As you see, last Friday night, this game, he broke broke a few, you know, big big plays. And one time, he stepped out of bounds, just just half a step out of bounds, he could have went all the way. And Marshall County was a good hit team, and at one time, Mike Michael got hit on a kicking team. And, he did hurt his knee, and he'll he'll probably be out about a about a month, hopefully not that long, but maybe he, he might be out, you know, just a little bit longer. Dimitri, again last year he hurt his knee, his left knee, and last again on the kicking game he got hit pretty hard and twisted that knee up a little bit, and it's pretty sore. So as far as this Friday night, we're not for sure, you know, whether they'll make it back or not. We hope they will, but if they're not, we'll we'll just have to bear with them and. Put what we got in there to make it through. Monty, my question is, how do you feel about this Friday night? How does it look to you as far as Hoptown goes against our team at Qualwell? Okay, Mike. Uh, we just have to switch every question, but uh, well, as Friday night goes, uh, we haven't got all the scouting report yet, but uh, where they what, from what they've told us, they say that they're stronger. Uh, offensively than they are defensively, uh, which is exactly the opposite for us, so it should be a pretty good fight. Uh, I think that we can beat them because uh, I think our offense is going to shape up this week because we really worked on it and we're coming off a loss we need to work. And our defense is toughening up. We're, we're going back, our offense is going back to blocking a wide tackle six, and I think we do better against the wide tackle six than we do the, the five man front at the odd front. Well, thank you. Good luck to you. Thank you.